Hello again, I am Blunty. I would not normally have the microphone in, in frame with me because I find that distracting and unprofessional when I see other creators doing it. And there's no need for it, as you've seen in pretty much every video I've ever produced. Your microphone can be off frame and you can still sound wonderful, but as you might be able to hear at the moment, I'm sick. And I'm afraid if I put my microphone in the usual position, I won't be able to project enough for you to be able to hear me properly. I have been trying all day to record a regular video using my regular presentation voiceover type voice video about the Linux gaming machine we've been experimenting with. And when I built live on stream and everything is a bit of a follow up uh, to an earlier video I made about Linux gaming machines. And I just can't do it. If I try and speak with my regular if I try and speak with my regular voice, we should just do this entire video ASMR style. How about that? It's much easier on the voice. And I've had to turn the gain so far up on the microphone. You probably heard that truck reversing outside too. So firstly, sorry to those of you who've been waiting on the Linux gaming vids. I'm going to try real hard. I'm going to drink a lot of lemon tea and, and get some butter menthols. Uh, thumbs up to any Australian out there. But menthols, aren't they good? They do crap all for your actual sickness, but they taste good at least, full of sugar. And, and I know what you're thinking, and yes, it is kind of a dramatic time to start feeling sick. I've been feeling sick for a couple of days now, and those of you who join me on my live streams over on Twitch will know I've been getting gradually worse for the past couple of days. My symptoms don't directly align with with the that that scary virus that we're not allowed to say on YouTube because they'll demonetize you as soon as they get a whiff of it. Although YouTube have started to reverse that policy and now I'm kind of regretting them reversing that policy because I'm starting to see some videos out there that are just scaremongering or just trying to, in the sleaziest possible way, sort of profiteer of people's fear and concern about the, the, the V word, the, the C word, V word. So for the first time ever, I'm kind of like, well, maybe YouTube's attempt at censorship was doing us a favor. The good news is... The good news is, it's a really good time to be a gamer and be sick, or having to stay inside to avoid getting sick, uh, because we've got Fantasy Star Online 2, the North American uh, open beta, launches this week, which we will be live streaming. Hopefully I'll be able to talk. I might have to get a headset mic so I can just whisper. Uh, but also, Animal Crossing at the end of the week. So, Fantasy Star Online, an MMO action RPG type of thing, and, and Animal Crossing. Between those two games alone, one of them's free to play, which is even better. Uh, between those two games alone, there are huge time sync games you can just soak into. Nice and gentle, like, for hours and hours and hours and hours of your time. So, the questions today is, number one. What game are you going to be playing while you are avoiding contact with the outside world? Uh, number two, please come along to the streams. Number three, what's the dumbest thing you've heard someone say or do around this whole scare at the moment? Mine would have to be the hoarding, but not just the hoarding. This morning when I went out to get some milk, uh, I was in the, in my supermarket is devoid of all kinds of things. And I tweeted about this this morning, you know, toilet paper and pasta and rice and all that kind of stuff. There's nothing on the shelf. Uh, and I saw many Karens taking photos of the empty shelves to post on Facebook and be all self-righteous about it. At least one of which out of shot behind her was her trolley with one hand on it. She was taking a picture and her trolley was full of stuff. She was, you know, the hoarding type stuff. It had 17 cans of tuna in there and a, and a buttload of, 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 of rice and, and uh, breakfast cereals and, and, and no toilet paper because there hasn't been any toilet paper on the shelf for ages. But I'm sure if there was toilet paper on the shelf, her trolley would have been overflowing with it. But that, that kind of obnoxiousness around this whole hoarding thing, it's not just the hoarding itself, but the obnoxiousness and the self-righteousness and the outrage uh, and hypocrisy around this hoarding thing is it's really driving me up the wall. I wanted to get a video out today to try and forewarn you if there are no more videos this week, that's why. I think that'll about do it for this video. Even this much has taxed my voice too much, I think. I'm going to lie down in the dark and, and, and just watch some Stargate. I think I've been going through Stargate Atlantis again. 
near the end of it. I'm just just about to, just started season five. Uh, so that's that's part of what I'm doing. I'm watching a lot of TV in the dark, just trying to let my body heal. So to you and yours, please stay safe out there. Don't go nuts. Just just be responsible. Wash your hands. Do all the things you're supposed to do. But there's no need to to panic. And for those of you who are going to express concern about how I'm feeling at the moment, chances are it's not the C word, V word, because my symptoms, again, don't align with it. Worst case scenario, it is that. I'm taking all the responsible precautions anyway, uh, and I'm not in a high risk thing. So worst case scenario, I'm going to feel pretty crappy for a week or two, but I should be fine. So uh, thank you in advance for anyone who did, in fact, show concern uh, to the rest of you. Have fun in the comments down below bitching and whining about everyone else who's being real crazy about this. Ooh, I'm starting to get that sexy gravel voice. Hi, guys. No, that's not sexy gravel voice. That's something different. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Thank you as... So thank you for watching. I'm going to mute all these cops, by the way, because they sound disgusting. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the thumbs up and the bell and the subscription and anything else you do to support. And please stay tuned to the Twitter uh, and or the, the Discord. If you happen to be a, a Twitch regular, you'll know where to find the Discord link. Uh, because we will be doing a midweek. We will be doing a midweek stream with Fancy Star Online to the launch day of the open beta. Uh, and then, of course, uh, you know, everything else willing. Uh, Animal Crossing on the weekend and things like that. So if you don't see any more videos from me this week, keep an eye on Twitter. I'm probably still alive. Probably. Took a dark turn at the end there. <clears throat>